Hello, my name is Ardi and we are going to solve problem 3.33. So this is without any calculation. So this will be a quick video. Which of the circuits in figure 3.82 is planar? Planar means that it can be drawn in two dimension without any crossing between components. So for the planar circuit, redraw the circuit without no crossing branches. Okay, maybe let's name the branches here. This is not A, this is not B, and this is not C, this is not D, and this one here is not E. Okay, as you can see here, we need to connect not A here with not D. But there is no way to put to connect not A and not D to put this 3 ohm resistor without any crossing. You can try to stretch it here, but where to go, it cannot be done. Okay. Yeah, I think that cannot be done. Maybe, but yeah. Yeah, I think A is not planar. But let me know if you find any way to planarize this circuit. Okay, so A is not planar. Maybe the one who knows graph theory better than me. So that that should be. Do, do you able to make it planar? I don't know. Let me know if you know how to make it planar. And then for this one, let's name this node as node A. And this node here as node B. This node here as node C. And this node here as node D. Okay. We need to connect node A with node D without any crossing. But that should be done easily here. So let's redraw that. So this is the 12 volt circuit not a is here and not b is here we need to connect not b with not c here with that one ohm resistor one ohm resistor and this not d here and then that will be not c and we need to connect 5 ohm there okay 5 ohm and between not C and not A, there will be 3 ohm resistor. And between not C and D, there will be 2 ohm resistor. Okay, and we need to connect not A with not D, but without any crossing, it can be done easily. Actually, out by using this outside of the circuit. So we will have this resistor here, which the value is 4 ohm. And that will be connected into node D. And so this is the planar circuit. So my conclusion is B is planar. And we have redrawn the circuit we have redrawn the circuit and hopefully this provide a satisfying explanation and see you in the next video bye bye